is a runner grounder really turns into Mariah Carey step by step. Almost the same manner of singing. I ain't even mad, no, not like before. Off with your head now, still there at the door. So how to learn to sing with the same beautiful subtone? I can't have what I want, but neither can you. One dark night. So let's take Ariana as an example and learn how to make the same beautiful subtone. Hello to all professional singers. With you today, your vocal designer, Veronica Worship. They are so similar, almost the same manner of singing. Both of them use a mask singing, both of them have a wide voice range, an excellent whistle register. Push vocal fry. But I don't wanna miss your touch. One dark night. An excellent voice flexibility. But this subtone is just marvelous. Bright and distinctive feature in their voice. It's written upon the sky. So how to learn to sing with the same beautiful subtone? So let's take Ariana as an example and learn how to make the same beautiful subtone. I know, baby, so, so Ariana Grande, boyfriend. So what is interesting in this song for us as vocalists? Firstly, vocal fry. I don't wanna be too much. I don't wanna. I don't wanna be. Sing the same way. I don't wanna be too much. Your turn. I don't wanna be too much. Try again. I don't wanna be too much. I don't wanna be too much. Notice how on the sound M her voice interestingly ringing. Too much. Making the sound beautiful and rich. By the way, this is thanks to singing in a mask. I don't wanna be too much. Try to sing not too much, but too much. As if to ourselves, hidden vowel n. Too much. You hardly even heard that n, but it helped us put the position right. Our vocal muscles and tongue, so that we hear this m as sonorous as it should. But if we just sing like that, it's such simple. Too much. Mm, too much. It turns out dull, but if too much immediately rain. Now your turn. Too much. You try. I don't wanna be too much. Now sing like that. I don't wanna be too much. Try again. I don't wanna be too much. Of course, this is not a solution to your problem. Ideally, you will need to adjust your voice, your vocal corridors, depending on your vocal habits and how well your head resonator is developed. But at this moment, to get the result right away, do as I told you. If you really want to sing beautiful, professionally set your voice, make your singing powerful, develop voice flexibility and master vocal embellishments and melisma. So I want to please you. Our course Vocal Fitness is now available for you. This is a professional complex of vocal exercises and vocal warm-ups for five days of the week. You can work with it at any time convenient for you. And doing only about 25 minutes a day, you will be able to sing your favorite songs without any problems and already perform vocal embellishments and melisma that are in it. Let me go. If you want to buy this video course Vocal Fitness, write to me in the social network or mail me. All links below in the description of this video. Know, baby, so, so, baby, so, 
So subtone, for those who don't know what is it, it's a breezy tone. But more correctly, it's a singing with a slight hoarseness in a voice. Yeah. And remember, anyone can learn this technique. One dark night. Remember, subtone is a very quiet vocal technique. And the most importantly, this is to achieve a beautiful, bright, as if hoarse voice. What you have to do for this? First, swallow your saliva. The mechanism by which you swallowed your saliva, as the second mouth is called. So, this is our first mouth, and that one, the second mouth, by which we swallow saliva. And very soon we will need it. Our second mouth. The second you need is well-developed breathing. And I'm talking now about the support of your sound. And then only a uniform distribution under pressure of your exhale. I know, baby, so complicated. Imagine that you want to defrost with your warm exhale a small mirror that is covered with hoar frost. And of course, you try to do like this. <sighs> and the main thing is to do exactly that. Distribute your exhalation so that it is evenly noisy and warms your palm. Your turn. Once again. Your turn. And now imagine that you breathe out a sound in a whisper whisper in a whisper with a very, very high note for you, really very high. And at that moment, when you imagine it all, and at that moment, your vocal apparatus responds to this picture and you really get that very necessary hoarseness in your voice, the same quality of sound that we need. Your turn. And sing in a whisper. Now you hear the slight hoarseness in a voice. This is exactly the effect that we need to achieve for a healthy and proper subtone. As if your voice really got sick and you speak in a such a hoarse voice. Very strong hoarseness. I know we be so complicated. And now we'll sing with Subton a line from a song. I know baby so complicated, but baby so spending is crazy. Now you sing. I know baby so complicated. Try again. I know baby so complicated. And the last try. I know baby so complicated. So you look up and see the world. With the right subtone, you will never break your vocal cords. I say this because many singers came to me to correct their voice after improperly setting the subtone, because of which their larynx constantly dried up and their voice often got tired. And with their clear voice after subtone, they could hardly sing anymore. That's why you need to know all the nuances of any vocal technique what you want to master. But for many vocal teachers, it is better to bend the subtone, say they it is very bad for the voice and just close this topic. Or the subton is only for the elite and it is given only by nature to the singer. And unfortunately, in our days, they so still say about many vocal techniques and melisma, about vibrato, whistle register, rattle. Believe me, everything develops in the voice with due professional approach to each voice. So, if you need a professional help, advice or audit of your voice and vocal data, contact me. And on Skype consultation, we will solve all your vocal needs. You can definitely achieve everything you dream about and you can become a cool singer. Be persistent and aim for your goal. Vocal success to you!
If you want to get personal training with me or need help in preparing your song for studio recording, you can contact with me by links below.